She's hauling ass. So we're back. <sighs> Lazy whiskey. Oh, wow. Glad you made it back. You're in for a treat, and hopefully so are we. He's Art. This is Tim. That's High West, a mid-winter night's dram. I've never had it. I'm pretty excited for this one. Dude, I'm so proud of myself that I just said that without looking at the label. You know how hard that is for me? It's freaking, <laughs> oh, anyway. So this is one of those annual releases. I'm turning around so I can cheat. I'm this is listening. Act 8, Scene 5, Limited Engagement. They do this every year. It's if you see it, buy it. Don't ask questions. Just just buy it, okay? Anyway. We're never going to find this again. I can tell you how I got that. What's that? So, story with that bottle is my brother-in-law's getting married. Or, my yeah, my brother-in-law's getting married. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers to him. There's more in that glass. Um, Who poured this, Jim? Very happy about that. <laughs> very happy you even pour it. <laughs> hey, I'm not mad at you. Anyway, so... Brother-in-law was getting married. His we did a bourbon tasting for his bachelor party, which is phenomenal. So this one uh, was provided by one of his friends that uh, worked at a liquor store, and they got like three of these, and he grabbed one. Nice. So, and I think they were the only ones in the area that got it, which is pretty sweet. Well, dude doesn't really. He's not a heavy bourbon drinker, so he was like, "You want to keep these?" I said, "Oh, uh -huh. So yeah, so it now lives with me, and this will probably be the last time that it gets out. How much does the bottle go for? How much? <laughs> oh, you got it for free? I got it for free. We'll, so. we'll have to look that up. We'll have to. Look we'll drop it in the comment. Right. Just like it'll be right here somewhere. somewhere. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so all these pours should get a lot of. Uh, fruit. It's what super clean on the yeah. nose, so. Yeah. This one's. Fruity. It's yeah. Super. This is way cleaner on the nose. No, like no ethanol burn. Yeah. It could be because we're halfway through the bottle, but still. It's like, and it's had a chance to air out too. We, we poured these a little bit ago. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's, it's fun. Darker fruit still because hey, port wine. I jumped right. Oh, I told you. Oh, <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> yeah, that's why I said just nose alone on this one won me over with the other. It's just three that we tried. Yeah. Yeah. And High West, so this is one, and I was saying this before, that uh, so High West sources a lot of their distillate. So it's like one of those things where it's like, okay, did they make this one or not? Is this MTV? Sorry. I, Go ahead. No, this, I, we don't know if this one's sourced or not, the distillate at least, we think. Yeah. Yeah. Because typically on like uh, their rye and their double rye, they have it listed sourced or finished by or whatever. Uh, but this one doesn't have any of those comments on the label. so. Our assumption is that this one was actually distilled, and we could be wrong, was distilled by High West because they are a distillery. They just don't distill all the spirits for the item, for the labels that they make. Right. So like Double Rye, sourced. Yep. Still fantastic, but it's sourced. Yeah, Double Rye is um, MGP. Yeah. So. <sighs> yeah, no, this tastes great. Definitely get the, uh, the dark fruits again, right? The traditional port stuff. The nose is a little weak. I think it let it out a little too much, but it's still good. It is over the tongue like silk. It's so good. <laughs> oh. Sam, are you okay? <laughs> oh, I'm back. Dude. Licorice? Mm -hmm. Hello. Maybe? Maybe? That dark root flavor? It does yeah, have a dark root in there. Yeah. Anise, anise, whatever it is, yeah. whatever it is. So use I, that, I need to add that, that one, by the way. Just let you know. Use that fa. You use anise. that fa. Little star. Yep. Oh, yeah, little stars. Sorry, totally off topic. Off topic. It's okay. Mm. Man, it's just it just tastes mm. wonderful. It's bright, but it's not like. It's not bright because there's a bright fruit. It's just like the flavors just pop off your tongue. What is it that makes it special? Like in taste. Like it's unobtainium. Well, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> Never gonna find this. <laughs> or at least we can't. Um, not true. Anyway. Um, dude, dude, it does taste like there's some, some, man, some like anise, licorice, spice in that. So good, it's so clean. <laughs> Somebody look up the tasting notes on this. I, I gotta know. Somebody, anybody? Our offstage cast is working to find out the tasting notes. 
Breaking bourbon as breaking bourbon. What's the, here? What's the BB boys say? Oh, we are so cheating. Mm-hmm. We're not cheating. Oh, and the, the we're, not cheating. Part, we're just trying to confirm. So the hard part, so true. here's the hardest part about looking up tasting notes for this one. If you were just even trying to find a guide for hunting. Again, this is Act 8, Mid Scene night. 5. Yeah, Act 8, okay. Scene Mid 5. Midwinter Nights. It's only released this year. Gotcha. Midwinter and Nights. Trail. So, it, you... Once it's gone, it's gone, like everything else that's limited release like that. But then it's like the f getting tasting notes from anybody for this specific year yeah. is, is tough. I think the last one I found was from a couple years ago. And it was like, eh, it wasn't really there. But if you see it, buy it. For sure. say. I'm really trying to chew on it. I'm trying to figure out what that is. And man, I am struggling. All right, you ready? Yeah. For sure. Red, red wine. Yeah. Raspberries. Rye spice. Rice okay, spice. rye spice. Yeah, Fruit yeah. pie. Fruit pie? Maybe. That's a little like crusty, bready kind of. Yeah, yeah, I could find a little doughy. Grandma's goodness. Meets my bourbon. I like it. They say it's like a dessert, freshly, freshly baked. Uh, it is very mm -hmm. refreshing. It is refreshing. So, you know those little like single serve what? pie dessert things that you get at the restaurant always served hot? Yep. Think that and taste it. And it's, well, you can. Cause... No, nope. it's gone. It didn't make it. <laughs> I think my poor was happy yours too. I wish I could say I was sorry, but I'm not. No, that's good. That's real good. But yeah, gosh. I find that I'm buying it. Absolutely. Like a lot of other High West products. Too. Yeah. Another one. If you haven't had a double rye, try it. It's fantastic. That's good too. And you can find it. It's not allocated, which is amazing. Yeah. Yep. Not this, the double rye. The double rye. Anyway. So. Mm. Nothing. Off screen cast. <laughs> That's great. Well, I'm Tim. He's Art. This was good. Feeling lazy. Real lazy. Next time, guys.